Hi, welcome back to the Spirit's Path. This is D. Today's tarot card of the day out of the Wildwood Tarot deck is a King of Stones and Wolf. And this is four in a row, all right? And uh, you just had the King of Bows drop off that adder, you know, and he was asking you, where do you take charge? You know, that was that was eight days ago. The World Tree dropped off today. Um, but now you've got four court cards in a row, all right? Uh, two queens looking out for you. You got the king now who, you know, wants to give you that that advice, that guidance, all right? The king of stones is also, um, you know, the let's call it the head of security. You know, he's going to give you the most stability. He's going to give you the most security. He's going to, you know, show you how to make that materialism happen, all right? And, um, you know, with all four of these cards coming up, I mean, these are people in your life. This could be an aspect of yourself that you're looking at, looking for materialism, looking for security, looking for stability. Um, you know, and, and everybody's trying to help you on your path. Okay, these court cards, you know, could be people in your life to, to show you, you know, what that path is, you know, to understand, you know, to help you understand where you're going, whether that's a work situation, a family situation, relationship, social setting, however you want to look at it. Okay, but, um, you know, here you, you've walked out of the world tree. Here's your storyline. You walked out of the world tree and you, you're kind of lost. But the seer comes along and says, you know what, you know, I want to help manifest things for you. You know, and then, you know, as you're walking down the path, you know, storm's coming up. So you're looking for that endurance, you know, looking for that perseverance as you continue to go through. And then the four, you know, you wake up the next morning, you feel protected from the storm. And then, you know, the you look out in the waterways and there's that page of, you know, page of vessels, that otter. Okay. And, you know, he comes along and, you know, he's a messenger. All right, a messenger of, uh, of emotions and a messenger of, um, you know, psychic ability. All right, and, you know, he's trying to give you inspiration. He's trying to, you know, let you know that, you know, it's okay to harbor some feelings, but at the same time, it's, it's you know, you can't let them, you know, hold you back. That Queen of Arrows comes along, you know, you're, the river's leading into, into the pond, all right, and you see this beautiful swan, and that Queen of Arrows is there to remind you that, you know, what is it that you need on your on your quest? Okay, how can we? How can she help you transform? All right, that Queen of Vessels yesterday, swimming upstream, you know, from from the pond, going into maybe another pond, and she's asking you what's enchanting you, and then the King of Bows comes along, you know. Now the king's guard, you know, king of the bows is, is or the king of stones, the wolf, you know, he's a guardian of the dead on your journey on the journey to the underworld. Okay, and if you think about that swan yesterday, you know, she's going to go to her final resting place after she lays her eggs. All right, and that wolf is going to greet her and going to help her, you know, move on to you know, uh, transform into something else, into the you know into the underworld. Okay, now, like I said, rule, you know, kings rule the kingdom. You know, they're great advisors. And, you know, the stones is all about materialism, security, and, you know, stability. And we see that. We see that with these cards here, the five of stones and the four of stones. All right. Um, now, the wolf's a ruthless tracker and a hunter, you know, who loves the land and the world. And, you know, you've, with this, you know, they're going to be on your journey with you. Through the day and through the night, okay? Now, again, with the court cards, you know, this king is going to be somebody who's going to be very mature, all right? They're going to be pragmatic and steadfast. They are going to offer security and stability, all right? This king is especially is going to be a natural businessman. So this could be somebody you're working with. This could be somebody that gives you some advice, all right, around your finances, maybe a mortgage, you know, maybe an IRA you know, or something on that, how to manage things, um, this is also, you know, could be somebody that appreciates the good things in life. Okay. They, they know how to handle their money and how to handle it well. They've studied. Okay. They've studied the markets. They've studied, um, you know, how other people get rich. All right. And it's not necessarily rich financially. It could be rich, you know, in their own, you know, blessings. Right. So they, you know, they know how to get the good things. They know what it takes to get there. That good, that hard work. 
okay? If this is an event, it could be, you know, an estate sale or a land sale. It could be some, maybe some, um, uh, I can't think of the word right now, but, you know, uh, a realtor, all right, who's, you know, the ability to show a house or something like that, all right? This also could be have, have something to do with your health, somebody who's in good health, all right? Somebody gives you that financial support, as I spoke about. So now the question that this, this king asked, and there's a lot of questions out here, all right? You know, from all these court cards, you've got the page giving you the message. You've got the, both queens looking at each other, all right? If I can put this up there. They're looking at each other, and they're conferring, okay? They're conferring on what, what path you should, you know, what questions they should ask you so you can move along on your path. And that king of stones, you know, he's looking away from them, all right? Because he's thinking, he's thinking, you know what? I need to give this person some good advice on what, what's going on, all right? And that's what he asks. That's what the question he asks. What advice gives you the best security? What advice gives you the best security as you're walking on your path? She asked you yesterday, that queen of vessels, what's enchanting you? What's enchanting you and what advice can I give you for that best security? Well, you know what? I've kind of been down a little bit. I haven't been, you know, focusing on what's going on. All right. I'm not, I'm not swimming forward. I'm kind of stagnant. All right. And that wolf says to you, you know what? I understand where you're coming from. We all have a place where, you know, we have to sit back and relax. But here's the advice I'm going to give you. You need to have action need to have action and moving forward. That Queen of Arrows is asking you, what help do you need? What help do you need? What's enchanting you? What advice gives you the best security from moving from one pond to the next? And that wolf's going to give you that answer. That wolf is going to give you an answer of, you know what? As long as you're moving forward, and you're looking into um, doing things differently, you know, you are gonna have opportunities to find that help. That page of vessels, you know, where do you need to let your feelings show? And the wolf says to you, you know what? Here's the advice I can give you for your best security. You don't have to do it in public, do it in private. Let your feelings show, get it out of your system, move forward, okay? Don't don't let that hold you back. Don't get into a pity party and a woe is me. That's where that wolf is coming through. That four stones protection, he's going to protect you uh, on your path. He's going to give you the endurance, okay? And that seer who wants to help nurture you, put those two queens in there to help nurture you as well. You walked out of that world tree and met her, and the next thing you know, you're meeting a whole bunch of people. You're like at a, at, a, at a social gathering, six feet apart, of course. And all these different people are looking at you. They're giving you that information. All right? That King of Stones is looking at you saying, you know, where is life author offering you its riches? With a seer. And the seer is looking at you and saying, you know what? I've got it all. You can have it all. You can manifest whatever dream you want. All right? Stay true to yourself. Stay true to your path. Because as long as you endure th through the storms, through the trials and tribulations, you're going to come out protected. All right. The page wants to give you a message. You know, what deeper trust is being asked to you? And the, and the king of stones says, you know, that wolf says, where is life offering you its riches? If you can trust yourself. All right, and if you can trust the process that you're in, you can look forward to those life riches that are coming in front of you. The Queen of Arrows, you know, is asking you, what's that straightforward approach? What's that straightforward approach in gaining that deeper trust? All right, again, the wolf has said, stay focused, have faith, keep moving forward. Those opportunities are going to come along because you've been working hard. And then that Queen of Vessels yesterday is, you know, asked you, what do you need to, you know, devote yourself to? 
Devote yourself to that straightforward approach as you continue walking forward on your path. Continue devoting yourself to gaining that faith within yourself, to gathering that deeper trust in the process of what's happening. And the wolf says, you know what? That's where your life offering is going to give you the riches. Okay? By understanding where you need to devote yourself, by understanding where you need to, you know, be straightforward, by understanding, you know, where it is that you have to develop in your own trust, the seer is there. The world tree gave you that insight and knowledge. It may be a little seed right now that's planted, but it's growing. Okay, the king of stones, that wolf, is asking you to stay fo stay focused. Your life riches, you know, the life offerings are going to give you the riches that are there. The opportunities are there. Stay focused. Keep moving forward. All right. Don't get into the woe is me, the pity party. So that's today's message out of the Wildwood Tarot deck, the uh, tarot card of the day, the King of Stones wolf. Hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave your comments down below and share it with others. This is Dee for the Spirit's Path, and we'll talk to you tomorrow. Take care, God bless, and stay safe, everybody.